hello on welcome back to another video so this week's spares idea is it is gonna be a bit little bit like sundays oh actually sunday it'll be sunday just gone by the time you guys watch this video oh, i have moments i tell you i could have done this for the for the other thingy but these are going to be a bit awkward to do and everything so i reckon that thingy so i've got this little power man another power man bargain i do love my power land you get some really good little bits in there these little cutlery things and as i have my grandparents at mine this year for christmas um each year we swap last for example last year I live in a I live in an area that we didn't have lockdown on Christmas Day. I was very lucky. My nan and grandma live literally live a three minute walk away from my house. So yeah, don't think that I I travelled or anything to go and see my grandparents. I didn't. Last year, um, I live in an area where we were allowed to go see people Christmas Day. We were safe, and other people weren't as lucky. weren't allowed to go see other people Christmas Day. I was. We were very very lucky. We managed to keep up, but we didn't. We. We kept separate, we didn't touch or anything, and me and my husband washed up our own cutlery and blah blah blah. Just keep things safe. Alright. So yeah, I got these cute little, you know the cutlery, um, you put your cutlery in. I've got these. I do have some really like I got some from Alex Fresh years ago. Like a uh, Santa pants, Santa top and everything. I think you can still get them and everything, but I thought I'm gonna put our names, I don't know where, I'm either here or going across. I reckon I'm going to have to put them going across like there because it's quite a wide area. So yeah, that is this week's spares or idea. Really, really looking forward to it. Um, so you're going to need a plastic bag, your glue. Um, this will be ideal for me to try to see if plastic glue works for this. Um, you know, sticking the diamonds on something. So that is the idea. If not, I have the old B7000 glue, which I know will stick, will work. That stuff, I don't think it, anything, it won't stick. I bet if I put two bricks together with that stuff, it'll stick. That stuff is amazing. I love that B7000 glue. <laughs> uh, so yeah, let's get cracking and let's see how we get on. And I, Do you know what? My husband goes to me, he goes, he was watching... Um, the blue dog one video and he goes oh you move your arms a lot don't you and you talk i was like oh thanks <laughs> so i'm like this though. i'm like he goes you're like a composer really you know da, 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 da. <laughs> i was like thanks husband that's really nice for you to say Amy, he's lovely he really is lovely to me so yeah Tell us down, down below in the comments that he's mean. <laughs> so yeah, let's be cracking and let's see how we get on. So I am all set up, ready to go. I have chosen this green, this nice um, rhinestone green. I put a bag inside me stocking just to protect it. Just so I know I'm not going to get, um, what you call it, everywhere um stick it together really so i feel like i said it'd be best if i did like the letters here along this bit here and then just purely because obviously i've got to do the word granddad and obviously that's going to take up a lot more thingy so I do have um, fabric glue, but I'm not sure how well that's gonna stick these individually on. So I thought, do you know what? We'll go with all faithful and I will just use the old B7000 because I know I, that will stick, you know. We could, I reckon it'd stick to have two house bricks to get together if I did it. Um, so what am I doing at the moment? Um, I was just literally, before I 
as I was setting up and everything. I'm going to show you. Come on, unlock. No. Just watching um, my friend Diamond Painting underscore Claire. The Diamond Painting Claire. Um, I'm just watching her. As you can see, I'm just watching her. Um, what do you call it? Um, um, as she's doing some Christmas decorations. I'm just watching that at the moment. And yeah, I, I kind of like a bit addicted to Bondi Rescue on YouTube. Um, <laughs> I don't know why, but I just love watching that show. Oh dear. Yeah, I kind of like watching Bondi Rescue, you know. I kind of, I kind of got a little, little obsession with that because I'll just, just, just carry on watching them and everything, and yeah, um. <laughs> so busted on that one, Jim. But yeah, I'm just literally, I'm watching Claire's at the moment, and so when I go on to the old time lapse, I shall carry on watching Claire's video. I do try to watch as many videos as I can for like the. The smaller diamond painting YouTubers. Claire, I've been watching for a long while now. I mean, a long while. Um, yeah, I've been watching her for, her for ages. And then there's another lady I just started watching. Um, I don't get to watch all of them because she basically uploads every day. It's crazy Borgies, I think. And obviously, I've got my friend Imogen now. She now changed her. YouTube name to Grandma Yaya, uh, Diamond Painting Reviewer. I'm pretty sure that's what her full name is now. But yeah, um, I do try to watch as many people as I can. And if you think. Um, who else do I watch? Oh, was quite funny. I noticed... Um, Somebody I blocked from my YouTube channel ages ago. They can't comment. Well, they can comment, but it, it automatically goes, gets deleted if they try commenting. They've actually started making videos themselves, I noticed the other day. And yeah, so you do you love, you know. The funny thing is, though, I, this person, you might you know who it is. This person must actually know I'm talking about them just by the comment because they were complaining that the ladybirds were boring because I'm doing the same thing again and again and again. Um, the funny thing is that they've just um, done they've done that. Well, I thought I have a little sneaky peek at their YouTube channel. I didn't use leave no dislikes or nothing. I won't, you know, I'm mean like that, petty. But I just thought I have a look see you know what they're doing in theirs and they've done the same thing they've brought three pictures of a snowman from different sellers to see what they look like see what the differences are and i was like you were moaning at me for doing that and now you've just gone ahead and done it yourself so yeah it makes no sense to me but hey ho I was like, pot, kettle, black, love. But hey-ho, if that's what you want to do, you want to be a negative nearly like that. So I just, I blocked her from being able to comment on my videos. So I just thought, it was getting boring. Every video I'd upload of the um, ladybirds when I was doing the ladybirds all the time. Every week she'd be like, oh, this is so boring. It's the same thing again and again and again. And I was like, well, you ain't got to watch. I'm doing this for the people who want to see what the quality are like from different sellers on AliExpress. And, you know, it was quite interesting for people to see. Oh, poo bags. I just, my, my glue just leaked over there. Oh, and I just hit my... <laughs> I'm not doing very well, am I? Oh, Gemma, you having a moment? 
Um, so yeah. I was like, okay, pop kettle black love, but okay, you do you. Good luck on your YouTube journey. Right, the only problem about these is they get really stringy. Like the material, the, the bits of material really comes off very easy. Let me try with the old tweezers. Still got some of these, and if I've got four, three, six, nine, twelve, if I've managed to hunt out, so I've got three, six, nine, yeah, I've got more than twelve. I can do a bit of holly if I've got enough of these green. got enough of this green then I will do three of them to make three holly berries and then do the leaves I think that will look good basically just like little um Little place settings, really. For Nan. And then we think. And then we think. Jimmy, you do plant some random things at times. It's not perfect. Nowhere near perfect. But. It's handmade. Stop to my finger. Here we go, there we go. That's my land done. See what I mean? I've just thought I'd pull it up to see what happens and it's stuck to the bag. So it's a good job we did put the um, bag inside it. It stopped it from sticking to each other. So yeah, good job we did that. And so all I do is poke the end of the bag in the stocking, get your pen and ram it down and then hold it there just to make sure that this is all in the end because obviously we're stopping it all from sticking together. Do do gem next. I've got a big old blob at the end there. Uh, I've got something I can must make sure I keep putting the lid back on.
Oh, stop to it. Where's me lead? 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 I've lost me lead. Where about me lead? Right, let me know. Just to keep that from leaking even more, I do have some more in the. I have ordered more because I thought, right, keep it coming each month. Because I noticed, like, when you wanted to buy two, it charged you like one pound of shipping, but it was three for one. So I was like, nah, I'll just order one each month. Or I could have just ordered a couple, but separate orders. So I just order one. One a month. Keep them coming. So. I am not a fan of using tweezers. I've never been a fan of using tweezers. I know some people do the whole diamond painting with a pair of tweezers. And I'll tell you what, after a little while, my fingers, they start cramping up big time. And I'm like, how on earth does somebody manage to do a whole diamond painting with a pair of tweezers? If you're one of those people that can do it, I'll take my hat off to you. You have so much patience, it's unreal. So I thought I'd quickly show you how they look before we go to the old outro for the video. They look super, super cute, don't you think? I'm not, I haven't gone too mad on them. I didn't want to go too, like, crazy. But yeah, it took me a while to figure out which way is the best way to do the berries, to do the holly leaves. So I kind of messed up on mine and my granddad's. <laughs> And then Simon and Nan's do look really nice. So yeah, you can like add extra little bits. Like I've got these gold ones and these white ones and all different other colours. But I thought I'm just going to keep them a bit more simple, not too OTT. But yeah, I'm really, really pleased with how they've come out. So let's go to the outro. So my little... Um, like cutlery stockings are done. What do you guys think? I, I left them really simple. I could have like stuck some other different colour gems on them. You can do whatever you want. If you've got them little stars and stick them all over, and they will look really pretty too. So yeah, that's what I've done for this video. Just a little, little spare project. Nothing too like OTT or anything. But I do think they've come up really cute. Really, really happy with how they come up. So yeah, really, really pleased with them. So yeah, I am really pleased with how that's come up. Really pretty, really, really pretty. So yeah, hopefully you guys like it. You know, just a little. This actually did take me long to do. Just over, an, just over an hour to do all, all four of these. So yeah, it didn't take too long um about an hour hour and a half something like that didn't it wasn't like a major like 
time consuming thing so yeah that's how i've done these i think they look really cute and i think my nan and grandma think they think they look really cute on christmas day too so yeah really really pleased with how they come out so yeah i did kind of mess up on a couple of holly leaves because i weren't quite sure how to do it the berry because normally you do the berry for the thingy and i clicked how to do it best to do the two in the corner first and then the single one instead of the single one in the corner and then two thingy to get the be able to put the holly leaves in a better position so yeah for anyone else that does do this that is the best way to do the holly leaves if you want to do holly holly leaves and then all i did was one two three two three two one just to kind of get that rough holly leaf shape i can't close so i can show you guys as you can see that's how i got the holly leaf shape so yeah really pleased with how they come out so yeah, that is it for this week's first video. A quick one this week. Um, I was just trying to think of different things to do, you know. And I saw these, I thought they are really cute. And I thought, well, they're only a pound in the old pound land. And I thought, I could decorate that up with a bit of glue. I reckon um, the old wood, they're not wood glue. Um, fabric, it should work, honestly. Um, I'm not, I have got fabric glue, but... I keep going back to the old beef 7000 because that stuff is like cement when it's when it's dry so obviously you can see like with this I'm, I'm rubbing quite hard this pencil case and it's not coming off so I mean you must can hear how hard I'm rubbing it so yeah they do stick on really hard so yeah, that's why I keep going back to that B that B that B seven thousand glue because that stuff is does set like cement. So yeah, so that is it for this week's spares video. Thank you ever so much for watching. Don't forget to give me a big thumbs up if you like this video. Comment down below if you what you think of this spares idea. A smaller one, but I still think they're really cute and it's something that's going to be useful for me um, and for you guys too. You know, you can put them away. And pull them out and what i want to do say to me nan i said do you want to take these with you for next christmas you know so yeah really really pleased how they come out and that is it for this video so thank you ever so much for watching and if you haven't already please subscribe so yeah thank you ever so much for watching and i shall see you next time bye everyone